Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we are getting ready to go gardening. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. That's beautiful. But first, we gotta go get some lumber and supplies to make the garden bed that uh, we talked about. We're gonna do stair-step garden bed. Pookies! And it's gonna be for the herbs. Are you ready, handsome man? I am. He's, he's scaring me. Oh, I know. He's frightening, isn't he? All right, let's go, Miss Princess. Yeah, that's because I sold them already. Just those little guys left. They're cute. Aren't they cute? No, we cannot have any yet. Eventually. How many are they? Um, three, looks like. All right. We finished shopping at uh, Ace Hardware. And Michael is going to transform this set of stringers into a herb bed along with that wood and we got some more project wood over there piled up in the corner that we're going to use to frame out some of the trees all right here is the herb bed that michael made out of the stringers <laughs> you're silly and um that's where we're gonna put some more herbs this year it's right next to the dogwood tree what do you think? <laughs> You're silly. Thumbs up. He did an excellent job, didn't he? I think so, too. Now to continue work on the garden. We planted corn here, cucumbers over there, then we've got tomatoes and some green peppers. They're already started, and we have some other tomatoes started in the pot. But what I wanted to show you is the uh, pecan root. We put that in the ground and you can see how much bigger it's gotten since that first video that we did highlighting the root when Michael first brought it home. And you'll see the difference. This is the pecan root. It is now officially, I guess you could say, a pecan tree or a sapling. <clears throat> so we're gonna, as you can see, put a bed around it and uh, that way the grass won't crowd it out. We'll have to get rid of the weeds and whatnot. But that's the pecan root. You can see our blueberry bush is starting to get uh, its flowers on there, which is a good thing. And we also planted the pomegranate tree. So there is the pomegranate tree. Somebody gave us that. <clears throat> We've had it in a pot for a while, and we figured it was big enough now to go ahead and put it in the garden. So we did. This is our cedar. I've showed you that before. And then over here we have our cigar plant. The hummingbirds love that. Some Shasta daisies. Some other flowers. We planted wildflowers and things today. And then over there is our lemon tree, magnolia tree, mimosa tree. And there's my handsome husband. <laughs> Hi. I love you. I was showing off your handiwork. All right, and over here we planted some sunflowers in these pots. Last year we had them planted over by the uh, shade area. And they came up fine, but the deer came through the woods and ate them. So we're hoping that the deer won't make it this far and we'll be able to actually have sunflowers this year. So we planted those there and planted some more ground roses over there by seed. And then in these little pots here, we planted scarlet trumpeter. They're climbing vines. And hopefully they will climb up over the trellis. We're going to attach them to the trellis, but the paint was still tacky. So we didn't want to do that. We just took the regular throwaway plastic pots and we saved them, reuse them over and over, and we spray paint them different colors and whatnot, and then just repurpose them throughout the yard. And that's what that is. Admiring your handiwork. Since we didn't videotape it, you want to tell them how you made it? Um, out of wood. <laughs> Wise ass. <laughs> All right, Trinity, what did we just do? Trin? Did some wildflowers. That's right, we Come did. Yeah. 
Ja. That's wildflower seeds for the fairy garden. You did all of it? All the whole thing? All sides? Yeah? Okay, good. And hopefully we'll have pretty flowers for the fairies. You think they'll like them? Good. Go over here and check out what daddy's doing. We got to water over here too later. Because I put some there in this bed. We used a shady mix. It was an all-in-one uh, fertilizer, soil, whatever. You're just supposed to sprinkle it and let it go. My honey is building a ginormous herb bed for me. So I can have lots and lots of cooking herbs. Trinity, what kind of flowers did we plant before? What special kind of flowers besides the wildflowers? Flowers you eat. That's right, flowers you eat. Nasturum, we planted some nasturum. Huh? Nastrum is yummy, that's right. <laughs> And what do you call that? Fidget spinner. I know, but what did you name it? Winter Death. Winter Death. <laughs> You're very good at that. Look, there's our wildflower shady mix. See, it's all in one. Just sprinkle, water, and grow. 100% guaranteed, so we'll see. And there's our nasturum, and we planted some sunflowers, and we're just uh, getting everything ready. <laughs>